welcome back guys so this is question number 15 and here we again have to draw the logic circuits represented by each expression okay so the first expression we have here is a b plus a b whole prime okay so that is the first question here we have so we can very easily see that here only two variables are in what and those are the a and b so this is a this is b so only two are involved here so it can be very easily seen that we have only two inputs so we have a and b here and the signals from them are this is a this is b so what has been performed here initially the product of a b and the complement of them will be added together by using this or gate okay so we can see that this is the or gate so here we should have first okay we will have this and gate and through this and gate these two inputs will be given and here we will have what a b okay so after it as this is the input after it what we have to do we have to apply this not gate in order to get the complement of it and in order to get the complement of it we will get a b whole prime so again we have a b prime and a b as well and those two are what those two are added together just like here so what we have to do here we have to use this or gate as well so here we should have this or gate to which a b prime and a b should be given as given here and it will give me what a b plus a b whole prime so do i have this signal here yes it is already here and that is basically this one okay and similarly a b prime is also here and this is connected here and we will get this output which is shown here okay so that is the solution of part a here which i have to perform okay so that is the solution of part a similarly for part b here we have a b c d so this one is also very easy in which we have to uh, find the inputs first so we have four inputs here which are a b c d so a d c d okay these will have first second third and fourth signal okay and here we will have to multiply them together in order to get the answer okay so that is the product of them and it will be what it will be a b c d okay so that is the answer of part b similarly for part c we have a plus b c so let me move down so we have here we can see that we have a plus b c so c is a plus b c so here we have three inputs a b c okay so what do i have to do here first of all i have to multiply them together and then i have to add the product of b c with this a okay the same as we have done previously so the first gate i will have here so the first the inputs are here and the first gate we have is the and gate okay so that is the and gate and here we will have what there we will have these bc so at the end here we will get bc okay so with this bc i have to add a so for it i have to use this or gate here okay and it will have two inputs here i should have a and here i should have bc okay so this will be connected here and here i will get a plus bc which is the output of my circuit which has been given a plus bc okay the, the last one is uh, d so let me write it here part d is a b c plus d okay so that is the same question which we have previously done so i am not going to do it again 
so initially uh, let me give you the idea here is that here a b c uh, these three will be multiplied together by using the and gate okay and this and gate will be given with this or so this d and this and it output will be all together to give me this output okay so uh, that is the solution of uh, this question in which we have solved all the relevant examples which we have to solve here so um, that is the end of our question here and uh, i hope all of the steps which i have taken here would have been cleared so thank you so much and i will see you with some more examples in our upcoming video see you soon